The man who owned this house is okay after a gas explosion tore it apart. It happened on Hidden Hill Drive in Clinton. Crews are now investigating exactly what caused it. 10 News reporter Shannon Smith joins us now once again with more on the scene there. Shannon. Hey guys, the fire department and some good family friends are telling us that the homeowner here is lucky to be alive after that gas explosion earlier today. We'll show you some of the video. It's a little dark out now, but what we took earlier, what the uh, Anderson County Sheriff's Department tell is telling us is that it was he was trying to light some type of, of gas in his house when an isolated explosion occurred. The garage completely collapsed. It was an attached garage attached to the house and the man was somehow OK, a little bit hurt. Uh, our neighbor and a good friend of us, Gary, Bowers, who knew the people here, kind of explained what he saw when he came up to the scene. Here we are with an absolute uh, disaster. Ernie's standing there with blood running down his face, and he's got a big gash on his head, and he's holding his little chihuahua dog that's shaking. <laughs> Now, Gary talked to us just after coming back from UT Medical, where he got to see his friend there, said he's in high spirits, which is just kind of astonishing seeing what he just lived through. Even the fire department saying he's very lucky to be alive. Uh, Gary telling us that they will be keeping him overnight uh, just to make sure everything's OK. And he has lined up to to live with his son afterwards, since there's obviously going to be a lot of a lot of damage here. They are still waiting for a structural engineer to be on scene before the fire department can get inside and see exactly what kind of damage is caused. And they are working with Powell Clinch Utilities to see the cause of this again an isolated incident. They're telling people around here not to worry about their gas lines, but they are continuing to investigate. I'm live at Anderson County. We'll send it back to you guys in the studio. All right, Shannon, thank you.